Bear tutorials. Building a noise maker with bear paint and a triple five timer. Hi, this is Peter, and in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to make sound with bear paint and a triple five timer. We're going to use the bear paint to design and create a variable resistor, and then connect it to a triple five timer circuit to drive the speaker and generate some noise. By the end of this tutorial, you should have a working triple five noise maker circuit and several cool painted variable resistors to make some strange sounds. So what you're going to need for this tutorial is a pot of bare paint, a paintbrush, or you can use one of bare paint's new pens, a breadboard for connecting up your circuit, a battery, 9 volts, and a battery clip, a little piezo speaker, a triple five timer, two capacitors, a small resistor, some wire, and a bulldog clip so that we can connect our breadboard to our paper and paint, and finally a couple of jumper wires so that we can make sure all our connections and our breadboard are correct. Taking your pot of bare paint and paintbrush, we can start by painting a long thin line across the page. I'm making it thin and long to get a greater variation in resistance between the start and the finish of the line. Make a small connection pad at the start for connecting to the breadboard with our pull dog clip. Next we're going to create our connecting wires from our piece of, of wire and what we're going to do is cut two links uh, roughly the same, 30 to 40 centimeters long and using wire cutters we're going to strip the ends so that we can connect one to the circuit and one to our paper and on one of these lengths of wire we're going to connect a bulldog clip to the end threading it through the eye hole here and soldering to secure it. If you check the images on this tutorial page you'll be able to see more clearly how we've done that so check that. Looking at the circuit diagram and the breadboard schematic, you can now assemble the components onto your breadboard. You can download these files from the text on this tutorial page. Okay, so now you should have everything connected up on your breadboard with your battery and your speakers connected and your connecting wires included, uh, one of them being our bulldog clip. So all that's left to do now is to connect our circuit to our paint. So if we position our paint at potentiometer in the right place, we can simply connect it via the bulldog clip on our connecting pad. The only thing left to do now is to complete the circuit with our slider wire. And depending on where I'm going to touch, we're going to get different sounds. Okay, so you should have a working triple five noise maker circuit going and a painted variable resistor. If you have any more ideas with different designs of the variable resistor, make sure to send them to us if they're conducted so we can put them on the community page.
happy.